welcome to my channel. Let's compare fractions and arrange in descending order using butterfly method. So, paano ba gawin ang butterfly method? So, we have the first set of fractions, two-third, four-fifth, and one-half. Later on, i-arrange natin siya from largest to smallest. Unang step, i-multiply lang ang 2 and 5. So, 2 times 5, put 10 dito. Then, 4 times 3, the product is 12. So, ilagay yung 12 dito. So, na-compare na natin initially ang 2 third and 4 fifth. Now, how about pag 4 fifth, i-compare natin kay 1 half. So, mag-change ako ng color para hindi tayo ma-confuse. Gusto ko ng green. So, as usual, the same process. 4 times 2. The product is 8. And then 1 times 5, the product is 5. Okay. When you look at the products, we have 8, 10, 12, 5. So, ano ang pinakamalaki? Siyempre, 12. And this 12 ay naka-align dito sa 4 fifth. So, ibig sabihin, our largest fraction is 4 fifth. O, oh, isusulat ko na dito ha, automatic. 4 fifth ang largest fraction. Now, i-compare na natin ang natirang fraction. Ang 2 third and 1 half. So, let's multiply 2 and 2. So, 2 times 2, the product is 4. And then, 1 times 3, the product is 3. So, obviously, alin sa kanilang dalawa ang bigger or mas malaki? Siyempre si 4. And ito si 4 ay naka-align kay 2 third. So, meaning, si 2 third ang pangalawang highest fraction. Now, Automatic din, ang pinakamaliit ay one half. Yan yung pag-arrange ng descending order ng fractions. Proceed naman tayo sa letter B. Set of fractions, we have five sevenths, my three fourths, my eight ninths. Okay, gamitin natin yung Red na ink, the same process katulad ng nasa first problem. So, 5 times 4, 20. Then, 3 times 7, it's 21. Okay, initially, oh, when we compare 5 sevenths and 3 fourths, obviously, si 3 fourths ang mas malaki kasi the product is 21. Okay, let's compare na the fraction 3 fourth and 8 ninths. Okay, 3 times 9, the product is 27. Then 8 times 4, ang product ay 32. Okay, sa kanilang lahat, alin ang pinakamalaking product? Siyempre si 32. And 32, naka-align dito sa 8 ninths. So, meaning, si 8 ninths ang largest fraction. Okay. Dito naman tayo sa dalawa na i-compare natin. So, ang 5 sevenths and 3 fourths, katulad kalina, alam na natin. Sa initial comparison pa lang. Si 3 fourths ay mas malaki 
Okay, 5 sevenths. Therefore, 21, naka-align siya sa 3 fourths. 3 fourths is the second to the highest na fraction. And then lastly, obviously, ang smallest is 5 sevenths. Naintindihan ba ninyo? Sana medyo klaro yung pagka-explain para hindi naman malito ang lahat. Maraming salamat.